Hey YouTube, uh, this is a quick uh, real review about uh, why you should buy a digital converter box and what channels you can expect to get. Um, and the way you would check that is if you go to your browser, um, I'm using Google Chrome right here, and if you type in, um, just make sure the camera can see that, if you type in FCC, um, give me just one second, Type an FCC reception map. You should get a map that will show you um, what kind of channels you will get. And if you see the top search result right there, if you can in fact see it, um, what it does say is um, the digital TV transition reception maps through the FCC.gov. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that and um, we'll see. Uh, and this takes us to the DTV maps and we'll see what uh, channels we can expect to get. See down the top left corner of the web page you'll see a, play, a, uh, a field right here that says enter location. It says address, zip code, city, etc. So I'm going to go ahead and enter in my address which is 92882 and then simply click on the go button. And um, Signal strength calculations are based on traditional TV reception. Um, that's assuming an outdoor model 30 feet above ground level. So indoor reception might be slightly varied. So uh, what we find here is if you look at the left side of my screen, um, it'll tell you the signal legends over there. It'll say the channels that are green will have a strong signal, the channels that are yellow will have a moderate signal, the channels that are brown will have a weak signal, and the channels that are red will have no signal. So what we see through this reception map, uh, let me go ahead and zoom in right there, is that we would be getting um, KVCR, um, which is PBS. We would be getting uh, IND, which I do not remember uh, which channel that is. We would be getting... Uh, my TV, we would be getting Fox, ABC, IND again, we would be getting MTV, CW, TBN, NBC, um, PBS, Univision, Telefutura, um, or Telefutura if you speak Spanish, um, ION, um, NBC, PBS, CBS, Azteca AM, and uh, for, uh, we would be getting another PBS channel on a low reception. Um, so basically, if you go to the FCC reception map, it will go ahead and show you exactly what channels you would get based on your area. Um, let's go ahead and put in another zip code, for example. Uh, let's go ahead and put in 92683, which puts us just around there in Westminster. Uh, and we'll see just what channels they would get. See, now this calculates it based on um, the signal strength at, of the actual TV broadcast towers at that location. So now what this is actually, if you, if you have not figured out what this is, is this is, uh, say if you have a digital converter box like this, uh, which recently they had the uh, digital, uh, they had the analog to digital conversion. So basically any TVs that you had that was not using a cable box that you wanted channels on, you could still get your free channels. However, you needed a digital converter box, such as this one right here, which is the iView 3500 STB, which I will be making a video for, and I will be putting a link at the bottom of this video for it. Um, that's one that I personally vouch for. It's a very good product, um, and I've had very good results for it. So let's see. At this location, we would get MTV, CW, TBN, IND, PBS, NBC, NBC, ABC, uh, CBS, MyTV, Fox, Telefutura, I, uh, Univision, PBS, ION, and uh, a couple different uh, channels from the same, uh, um, from the same, uh, a couple different selections from the same channel. So what you would see here is based on this location, we would get, um, let's see, approximately 20 channels. Uh, that's a guarantee we will get at least 20 channels. Uh, so basically, let's say you um, you have a TV at home, but you don't really care about getting all the premier channels and all of those kinds of things. What you could do is go ahead and pick up a 
converter box such as this um, and an antenna such as uh, any of these ones right here for example I have a supersonic antenna right here um, which I will go ahead and uh, link in the description as well this is the supersonic SC603 um, which will all work perfectly for uh, getting you the basic channels um, you can expend, expect to spend anywhere from about um, uh, 30 to 70 dollars on the whole setup including your converter box and uh, everything of that sort and I will be uh, doing video reviews of those so you can expect to see them um, and I will post the links to them actually in this video um, and I'm sorry if that inconveniences you but they will be at the bottom of the video on the, about the bottom part of the screen right about here um, so go ahead and check those out you guys and please like comment share and subscribe and if you would like to check out any of the video reviews that I've made or buy any of the products there would, will be links in the description that will take you directly to amazon.com where you can purchase whatever you uh, desire and um, have a good day you guys.